Well, I'm glad you're here, bud. Thank you, sir. Thank you for serving. Ted News was there as actor Gary Sinise met local troops at San Diego's USO, but even his charitable foundation supporting the military is a victim of the government shutdown. The actor who played Lieutenant Dan in the movie Forrest Gump told 10 News the way the government shutdown affects the military is disgraceful. Sinise is here with his Serving Heroes program, but new at 6, 10 News military reporter Bob Lawrence has why the foundation wanted to do more but couldn't. Sinise took spatula in hand and started serving the troops himself. But for him, his involvement with the military is personal. The first in line for the inaugural Serving Heroes program, newly minted Marine Private Val Bailey. Sinise's foundation started this program at the USO at the Los Angeles airport a year ago. Hey, how are you? It's simply a way, he said, of saying he appreciates what they do. It's pretty cool. Never really met any, like, person like that. What he doesn't appreciate is the government shutdown. You want to get into that? Yeah. <laughs> I did ask him that because he's had to cancel two concerts for the military. One was scheduled at the Naval Medical Center Saturday. The shutdown, he said, is personal. My nephew just got back from Af Afghanistan. We have people still getting hurt, still getting killed. The government should stand behind him 100 percent without question. Lieutenant Dan is the character Sinise brought to life in the movie Forrest Gump, which in 2014 will be 20 years since it was released. Lieutenant Dan, what are you doing here? Sinise has played a number of roles since then, but if that's who he's associated with, that's fine by him. I'm, I'm proud to be associated with it. I, I realized early on... Uh, after playing that, that it had a kind of special connection. Three years ago, he created a foundation to help active duty and veterans, help that was certainly appreciated in San Diego. It feels good to know that someone cares and someone is here and just like, hey, you know, we care about you. A thank you that went a long way beyond serving up food. Bob Lawrence, 10 News. Good man there. Uh, Sinise vowed that the Invincible Spirit concert with his Lieutenant Band, Band, Dan Band at the Naval Medical Center will be rescheduled once the shutdown is over.